she will play it. Because she's a crazy gamer. Gamer, gamer. Hopefully this song is shorter for you guys. Because she thinks the last one was too long. But she still is a crazy cat lady. You gamer. Hopefully this is the last one because like before, I don't like singing these songs. Hi, so Finn's watching um Iron Fist season one season two a couple couple days ago. Um it was a lot better than season one. It's Iron Fist does a lot catch up to do to compare it to the other ones, but I guess that it's pretty much has gone better because the f the core graphene is a lot better. We don't really focus that much on um the brother and sister dynamic. They're still in it, but they're not that much focus on to it. And as we got to see more of Danny and Colleen in this and how they're doing with their new lives and the fact that this is permits spoilers for this for the season for the for the season like I always do. We can focus on their relationship and like stuff like that. Since Colleen wants to retire from doing from doing um from fighting, since what she what she was never basically she thought she was a hero, but she wasn't because she thought the hand was good, but it wasn't. So since she was right, she was thought to the news she found out she was wrong, and so she decided not to no longer be a fighter anymore. So, and Danny promised Matt that he would tell, he would take care of the, um, New York for him, since they all think he's dead. So Courtney decides to help, Con, Con uh, hard time to remember her name, Con, um, Con Lee. Sorry if I did say her name wrong. <laughs> um, goes and helps Danny. And while they're fighting, they have the bro. Um, he has best friend or brother. Help. Um, f is keeps on trying to get in the way because. He's mad at Danny for taking the Iron Fist from him when it was his destiny to have it, his birthright. Because unlike Danny, he was born in, in the city. He was born in Kanlun. Oh, that's the right one. Name. He was born in. The ancient, the ancient city. So he wants to go and get the Iron Fist back. So instead, Danny doesn't believe he he's right for it, so he gets again it to Colleen. And yet she doesn't believe she has right to it either. While his brother gets um. The the sisters siblings, the siblings um to help him, but by tricking him and getting a girl that kind of kind of has like a split personality named Mary and Walker to when she's like like going off the, the rails she's Walker and when she's normal and innocent she's Mary. <laughs> 
yet I think she's more wanting to protect this the sister than help and help get off to Matt. While the brother is still dealing with the fact that he was once an addict and finds out that he ends up being a being a father to a girl that, that he met in um on those attic meetings. And I get they're not she's not letting him see be a good let him be a dad. So at the end they do end up putting his I'm putting Danny's brother down, and Conleen gets become the fist, while Danny and the um, other brother go leave. And stuff, and from it's the in credit scenes that they're in like a barn, I think in somewhere in China, and somehow he gets the iron fist back, and he puts it to a gun. <laughs> so that uh, I give this um at least a seven out, at least a seven out of ten. So let's do let's watch the trailer of um dead Daredevil. Yep. You can suffocate evil. Starve it. Lock it behind bars. It's wearing the white suit. But it will find a way to come back even stronger. We're gonna have to kill it. There's only one true way to end evil. It for good. Let the devil out. So here's the next trailer. Love blinded me. My love for this city. My love for her. Are you talking about your girl? The the devil the took my now. throne, my freedom, and everything that mattered. But my eyes are open now, and he'll never see me coming. So go ahead. Let the devil out. Who's the devil? You or him? As always, Daredevil's always the best out of the four. To me, it's Daredevil. To me, it's the way it came out. To me, it's the way it... Daredevil, Jessica Jones, Luke Cage, and Iron Fist. I do. So, this one I've been waiting for. I just kind of wish this one came out before the other three. I'm kind of happy, but though, it's a good thing that they are. Then the other ones can kind of shine, and since they're all thinking that Matt's dead, and they all got time to cut, we have to see how they cope with his death. Now we have to see how he um comes back, since um the kingpin is 
going to try to say that Daredevil is the bad guy. And by sending out a guy who's dressed up as him in the, in the, the, older, in the newer suit. That's why he's wearing his older suit. To make Daredevil look bad. In fact, that we, I think we see in this that they had the the bad Daredevil attack Kingpin. Now, is he is Kingpin a whole entire time talking about the city, or is he talking about Vanessa? Because he did love Vanessa. <laughs> As much as you love the city. I do like how like the first trailer is about Matt's perspective. The second one's about um, Fist's perspective. So I did them both. And we were able to see both, um, both their situations about this. Because the two... Like the best two villains out of the, the out of the the Netflix series is the Kingpin and Kill and Killgrave, but definitely the Kingpin is the best one because we got this. We, his backstory is. Really good, and the dynamic between these characters is really good. Because we have to keep on wondering who really is the bad guy in all this. Because Matt keeps on saying he's the devil, but we all know that the Kingpin is to be the devil in this. But it's going to be hard for Matt not to kill the Kingpin, because that's against his... Is cold <laughs> or crossing the line. <laughs> That's because last season he tried to make sure that Frank didn't do that. Or Electra. So I get this these trailers. 10 out of 10. Can't wait to October. What do you give it, Sully? I give it. I get the. I got a fist. Oh, for pause, and I get the trailers of Daredevil for pause. Adieu. Bye, guys. Bye.